What's up guys, welcome to tutorial number 20 How to teleport player using box colliders on trigger enter Pause and read the brief if you have to And let's go ahead and get started Pretty easy because a lot of the code is already written for us And we have the check collision script which is played uh, placed on our capsule player Dude, so all we're gonna do is check if it collides with something called teleport would probably be a good name um, and when that happens we're gonna take our transform position and because this script is placed on a capsule player which is our um, our hero that position is going to equal our let's call it um, destination teleport destination something like that and we don't it's red because we don't have it yet and teleport destination is going to be a transform copy and paste and it's public because we're going to use a game object and click and drag it in there real quick into the inspector so we'll go over back to unity and look look at what happens it's getting red because I didn't put position. We get the red, the evil unity. Okay, whoops, don't do that. We gotta look at stuff. So now we're just gonna go um, copy and paste teleport and put it into your tag because we need a tag. So add tag, paste it in, boom. <clears throat> and one thing you always gotta do, I tend to forget, uh, Mm, tend to do this very often. We need to create a empty game object. So what we're gonna collide with or on trigger with will take us to a destination. 3D object cube teleport from and try to be um it doesn't matter. I like to add zeros, I think it's good practice. It requires more effort as usual. It doesn't matter. You'll notice though, a little effort early on will save you a lot of potential drama later on down the road in your game. Speaking from experience, copy and paste or duplicate, sorry, uh, command or control D and just change it to one or leave it, it's up to you. So <clears throat> this guy needs to be set to trigger and this one doesn't have to be, but if we don't do that, he's going to bump into it. So we don't really want to bump into it. And make sure that we're just going to move the destination around, make it a little bit high so then we can really tell it's working. So when dude runs into this, he's going to teleport to this. And how do we do that? We got to make sure that it has a tag, which we named teleport. Boom, boom. From there to there. And we need to do our destination teleport, which is. O one. Now, if Unity gods gods are kind to us, um, which sometimes they are, sometimes they're not. It'll work. Let's find out. Let's set it up so we can see the other cube. There we go. I apologize for all the white. The, the name of the game is White. So let's see what happens. Right. <laughs> Boom! Teleported. Matter was teleported successfully we did it boom just like that it didn't even come down that's awesome he's just staying up there but um you see it works anyways guys that's it and um the only thing i just disabled the uh level complete so we can test it and i turned off all the enemies and the arch and all Anyways, that's it. Pretty short and sweet. Pretty easy. Um, another little quick tip: if you wanted to get into it and you had maybe a lot of, maybe you had ten teleports or something, you could just turn um, teleport destination into uh, an array by going like that, and switch back over to Unity. Oh well, ignore that. That's gonna be a little bit different. Forget I said that. What I was gonna say was. You can have an array with 10, there you go, 
Now your teleport is going to be a little bit different though because you're going to have to get the point and array, the element, and blah, 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 blah. But anyway, you're a smart person. You can figure it out. Anyway, guys, that's it for today. And that's the final tutorial. Tutorial. Uh, 20 videos. Pretty good. All hopefully get you up and going in your game somehow. And um, that's it. As usual, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe, ring the ding, and um, I'll catch you next time. See ya.